All right, today we came to Wilson's village. Wilson, say hi. Hi. <laughs> cool. And we're gonna do some barbecue and ride some horses, so it's gonna be a fun day. All right, we arrived to Wilson's house. And he has a beautiful view. And that's a tomato tree right here. What is it? That's Wilson's uh, little dog. Tino. Tino. And they cultivate a lot of potatoes. So Wilson's mom cooked us some uh, caldo de castillo, and it's a really famous Colombian soup for breakfast. For breakfast? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> My grandma would like it. We are getting ready for some horseback riding. <laughs> And Margo is riding the horse. Now it's my turn to ride the horse. And we are approaching to a beautiful river. I fell down but I survived. Friendship! Salud! Salud! Perfect! Las vacas bonitas! Bonitas! Sí, y es eh, la vaca pequeña. Ternera. Ternera. The horse got tired, so now we're taking him back to the house, and now we are gonna have our lunch. While they are preparing lunch, I'm checking some farm animals that they have over here. We have a pig over here, and another pig. And we have the baby pigs. They are so cute. Alright, Wilson's mom cooked us some really traditional Colombian dishes and we are about to enjoy it. Yes, we are. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> oh my god. So, good morning everyone. Uh, this is how my day starts every day. And this is the apartment that we live with the other teachers. And this is the road that I always take when I go to school to teach English. passing through downtown Tunha. Uh, Tunha is located in Boyaca region and there are about 300,000 people here. And I'm having my delicious breakfast soup every morning. Mm. Now I'm heading to the language school that I teach English. And here is inside the institute.
the teachers, administration, and the students are so lovely here. You become part of the family right away. Can you remind me? So what are we eating, eating today? Because uh, uh, What is the picture with? Do you remember? Hola. Yeah, for Alright, so this is what we eat normally for lunch. So it comes with a soup and a homemade juice and a plate like that. So we eat for free here. And it's really delicious. Is it delicious guys? No, for sure not. <laughs> Again. <laughs> So right now I'm going to the supermarket to show you guys the prices of the fruits and the other things. can buy a pound of mango for 30 cents. Papaya is really cheap and delicious in Colombia and they are about 30 cents for a pound. You can buy 24 eggs for two dollars and a half. Two slices of steak is about two dollars. Let's get to the most important part, which is the beer. You can buy a six pack of beer for three dollars. And Club Colombia is the most famous one, so it's about four dollars. Liquor is a little bit expensive since they import it. Big bottle of water is only 20 cents. Here is the most famous Colombian liquor and it's called Aguardiente and it's about $10. Guanaba is a famous Colombian fruit and they are about 35 cents for a pound. Pineapples are about 25 cents. You can buy different varieties of bread from 60 cents to a dollar and a half. One pound of fresh ground beef is about two dollars and twenty cents. A big bag of Colombian coffee is about two dollars and ten cents. So I just finished with the supermarket and now I'm going back to the institute to teach some English. Thank you guys! Bye. <laughs>